direction and trajectory. These are two different concepts. And when you're doing a jump, I see that the direction will be towards the target. Okay, so I'm going straight and I have a two different trajectories. Well, actually I have multiple trajectories, but let's talk about direction first. So I'm going there. So my direction is here. So that is a pretty uh, straight dire direction and a narrow trajectory. So I didn't actually need to go that high to land on it. However, sometimes I see that, um, especially newcomers, when they jump to something, their trajectory is not high enough and it's what will pull them forwards. So it'll sort of land and then they'll kind of fall forwards. And it's because they're going straight at the target. So it's sort of like that and they'll fall forwards. Now, you need to increase the uh, trajectory. So the comparison here is direction, shallow trajectory. Here, I can now jump over the bin so it's the same jump, the direction is the same, but my trajectory is much higher and I'm coming down on the target. And this is what's key. You wanna come down on the target because that is what's gonna allow you to stick on the target. So think of it as an arch. So you've either got straight at it, which means that you keep going that way, or you can kind of go higher and come down, which means that you're going into the target. And it means, yeah, your feet are more likely to stick and you're less likely to fall forwards.